Hey guys, welcome back to my next video. I'm going to try and keep this one quite short and we're just going to look at how you can get some drawing guides onto your canvas. So like this that I've got set up in the background here, this is my reference image. I'm just going to clear these off so that I can show you. So to get these guides, we're just going to come up to this top panel and we're going to select view. And from here, there's quite a lot of options, but we're going to come all the way down to new guide layout. Now, when you select that, you can see some will come up automatically. This might look different depending on what settings are already preset for you. You can play around with a lot of things here. For example, we've got different rows or columns. You could just have one of those set. For this example, what I'm going to do is set my columns and rows to three. I think this is a sort of pretty standard way to go about it. And I'm going to remove this gutter or type in zero. You can see how that was like a double line. So yeah, you can play around with width and height, but by leaving these blank, you should get a very equal spread, which is what we're after here. So hit OK. And it's as simple as that to actually get your guides on screen. If your guides are still not showing up, just come up to this view section again, click show and make sure that guides here has a tick next to it. So a quick example of how you might use this and why I've got this image on screen is to get your drawings or paintings more accurate whilst you're practicing your art. So for example, if I open another canvas that's the same ratio, let me just make it so that you can see both of these at the same time. So we can use that same technique as before now on the new canvas. So select a view, new guide layout, and it's already got our last one saved by default. So hit OK. And that's it guys. So then you can see where your eye is on this one relative to the lines. Mark it in on here. Um, same for this one. You might say the eyebrow crosses through this bit here. And you know, so I think you get the point of how to use it. Oh, and one other thing really quickly to mention is that whilst you've got these guides on, when you're drawing past them, you might notice like that, it might sometimes get stuck on the guidelines. So all you need to do is select view and come down here and untick snap. Now you should be able to paint past these lines without them affecting it. I have actually made a video of me painting Obi-Wan here, so check that out. That's what inspired me to make this video on the guides. But that's it guys, so I hope you guys found this useful. If you did, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out a lot. Hit that like button and switch notifications on. Of course, don't forget to check out my other Photoshop tutorials. And let me know in the comments below what you guys want to see next. Thanks so much for watching everyone.